20 years ago, I helped create a gang called the Crips. Today, I'm speaking to you from death row. I never imagined that the Crip gang would spread throughout California, throughout the nation, throughout the world. And I deeply regret the legacy that it left because it left a legacy of genocide, black on black genocide. And I apologize for my part in it. But I am deeply encouraged to uh, see you here today that lets me know that I'm not alone in deeply regretting this legacy and seeing it for what it is. And no one could have a better influence on gang violence or gang culture than gang members themselves. And therefore best positioned to reverse this course of violence, but we must do work. We must get out there and we must forge peace. We must stop exterminating one another. We must stop all of this madness because at the end of the day, we, we have only ourselves to blame. We must uh, have a do or die attitude as we were as street warriors to rebuild our culture and to create a new lasting legacy, a legacy of peace.